Hey there, my friend and fellow trader. It's Will here over to fxace.com. First, a big welcome to today's video. So, start of another uh, trading week. Um, this video is going to be your free trading setup for the week ahead. So, before I actually get into the charts and show you the setup for the week ahead, if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed yet, simply hit the subscribe button now. So, let's get into the charts. I'll hide my face here and let's have a look. Okay. So this week's setup that I'm gonna show you and give you free. Remember, always trade at your own risk is on the New Zealand dollar against the USD. And I'm looking to sell this position uh this week. Okay. Now, all these these other setups are all my other setups for the, the week ahead on the weekly service. And we're looking at entry price at sell at 69.1, uh, stop loss 70, uh, 300, and take profit at 66, and a break even at 67.8. So a break even, if you uh, don't know what break even price is, it simply means when price uh, drops to 67.800, you simply move your stop loss to entry price. And usually what I do is close 50% of my position and move my stop loss to entry price, therefore lock it, locking in profit, and you can't really lose on the position. Okay, so let's head over to the charts and look at the Kiwi USD. If I can so Kiwi USD. Okay, basically this was a trade that I took uh last week and I'm looking to trade it again this week. Okay, so basically what I'm looking at here is you can see We've got this strong resistance area here was also a previous strong support. Okay, it's on the higher time frame, the weekly uh, area, the weekly charts, monthly and weekly charts is what I kind of look at for good possible trading zones. If we look at the monthly charts here, we have this area here that was this leg start to create this new low here. This swing high new swing low here was the area that actually started this move down here so it is a key area on the charts and i'm just gonna box that off there on the monthly uh time frames if you look at the weekly chart okay the weekly area here is this area here. Okay, you can see last week it smashed up into this area and dropped off. And again, I'm looking to sell this again this week. Okay, so basically if you look at the, the daily charts, okay, what I'm really looking for here, you can see we've got this higher time frame area here. Okay, this caused this. And uh, basically expecting the market maybe to pop back up around 69 on Monday, 69,100, and then I will look to sell the market again when it rallies back up. Okay. What I will also look for is a MACD divergence signal to occur anywhere from 20 to 50 pips from my entry. Uh, pending order price. So anywhere between 60 or 20 and 50 pips from 69,100, I will look to take, I will also look for a MACD divergence signal happening on a one hour, four hour, or daily chart. Now, if you've uh, got this setup video via email, there will be a link in the email to actually download the free uh, MACD indicator. If not, just simply contact me at willofthefxace.com. 
and I will send you over the free um, MACD indicator, okay, this indicator down here. Okay, so basically, very simple basic setup. Okay, we're at a strong uh, resistance on the chart, previous uh, area that caused a new low in this trend down. If we look at the weekly charts. Inside that monthly area, we have a nice weekly area here. Again, it is a strong resistance area. I'm basically looking to play the resistance again this week. Okay, it could, on Monday, it just could basically just plummet all the way down. Time will tell, but what I am actually expecting is the market to trace back up and then sell back off, okay? And again, looking to sell around 69,100. Either let the market at, uh, go to that price or look for a MACD diversion signal happening around there. Personally, I will, if a MACD signal happens, I will enter the, the market early and simply enter the price. So that's the trade. It is, okay, the basic sell, and said D, USD at zero. 69.1 or enter a manual mac the divergence signal on one hour, four hour, or daily chart. Okay. Personally, I would look for the one hour, four hour chart. If it happens pretty early, I would look to uh, take that. Okay. It can either be a continuation divergence, but as long as it is a MACD bearish divergence, okay. Bearish divergence. That's all you're looking for. So a bearish continuation or. <coughs> A bearish reversal divergence. Okay, that's all you're looking for. <clears throat> uh, stop loss. Seven oh three hundred and take profit is sixty six, and I'll show you why I'm looking to take the profit at sixty six right now. Okay, sixty six. Okay, so pause the video. Write that down. Remember, you want to enter this on Monday morning or Sunday evening, depending on where you are in the world, one to two hours after the market opens. Okay, so after the market opens, don't enter it straight away. Uh, allow the market to open, just in case there's high spreads or gaps up and gaps down. And enter the position. Uh, allow it to enter if it enters <coughs> with the pending order or if you enter with a manual signal throughout the week, always close the trade on a Friday evening at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time before the market uh, closes. So that's the position, just hide that. Let me show you the reason for the take profit. Okay, 66, and basically take profit is this area here. In the charts. It's actually the leg that caused this move up on the daily charts is the reason I'm looking to take profit down here because this will be, you will get a reaction here. So it is a good uh, take profit in around this area here. Basically, I take profit. Okay, last area that caused the last high comes back down to test it. So there we go. So that's the position. If you want to access the full uh, list of 21 possible trade setups for the week ahead, simply click the link below. Remember, if you got this free setup via email, uh, the MACD divergence uh, indicator would have been attached to that email. If you didn't, simply contact me at will at the fxes.com and I will uh, give you a copy of the MACD divergence indicator absolutely free. So click the link below. I'm looking forward to seeing you in the service. 
Have a great week and I shall see you on the next video, willover.fxace.com.